What is going on guys? So today's a travel day. Jeff and I are in a hurry. We're probably gonna be late going to the airport. We are about to go to Columbus, Ohio. So I'm gonna show you a little bit throughout my day what I'm eating at the airport, but I'll do a full day of what I'm eating while I'm traveling once I arrive in Columbus. Today is Wednesday, September 19th, and we're late. This is my airport outfit. I'm just wearing a little white top and some comfy pants. And of course, fanny pack. And then we got some suitcases. This is my bag here. This is my travel backpack, which is super dope. It has like really awesome compartments and all sorts of good stuff. So inside my backpack, I have like pea science protein bars that just in case I need to eat these while I'm at the airport. And then I also have various like protein powders. And then I also have a shaker cup, an empty shaker cup, which is really good to have while you're traveling. So you can put water in it or just have a quick protein shake. So yeah, we're late, bye. We just had a one hour flight, slept through the whole thing. Trauma mean means business. Me, I should have gotten the less drowsy version. This guy. Hey. Oh. guys we made it we are in Pickerington Ohio I'm actually staying at John Meadows's house or mountain dog he's been kind enough to let us stay at his home he has a beautiful home I feel a little bit wrecked because the time zone difference and when I woke up at 7 a.m. this morning it was like 4 a.m. this morning almost 10 a.m. now and I think we're gonna go get some breakfast at first watch and then I plan to go to the grocery store to pick up a few groceries so I'm happy to be back in the States feels good and I'll see you at the first meal it's so nice. So bizarre how warm it is in Ohio. Hi. John, welcome to the video. Hi everybody, how he's, are you? He's letting us stay at his home. John is an IFBB Pro bodybuilder and he's also an amazing coach. And in my next video, he is going to be taking me through a leg day. So that's pretty exciting. I'm a little bit scared. Don't uh, be scared, <laughs> it's easy stuff. It's a piece of cake. I'm a little bit scared, I'm a little bit scared. We're gonna be doing a few videos on Jeff's channel and then a video for my channel as well. So I'm super excited about that, but we are going to get some breakfast. All right, let's get it. All right guys, so I got an egg white omelet. It's called the triathlete omelet, but I got an extra egg white, so you know, I'm hungry. And then I got some fruit and some fresh salsa, and this is dry wheat toast. So I'm gonna enjoy that. I'm lucky enough that First Watch does have a lot of healthy options here, so it's easy to pick something off the menu, but I'm going to enjoy this, and I'll see you guys in a little bit. Okay, so we just got back from breakfast. Breakfast was absolutely delicious. Um, with my first meal, I typically take all my vitamins, so I'm just gonna show you what I'm taking. I have this little travel uh, pill container. So in here I have my digestive enzymes, my fish oil, and then I also take uh, True Multi. So I'm gonna take this right now because I just had my first meal and I didn't wanna bring it to the restaurant with me, so I'm just gonna have it right now. I'm not really sure what we're gonna be doing next, but at some point today I do wanna run to the grocery store, so we'll see when we do that. I think also later today we're gonna be getting some sushi, so today should be fun. So if you guys know me at all, you guys know that I love the grocery store. I like going to different grocery stores. It just makes me happy. I'm currently outside of Kroger, which is the local grocery store in Ohio. So I'm gonna pick up a few things that I would normally pick up when I am traveling or when I'm staying at an Airbnb. So I'll show you what I get. Okay guys, I'm back from the grocery store and this is actually 
actually John's second kitchen. I don't know if he has three, but this is kitchen number two. So this is the one that's in the downstairs basement. He's um, letting me do a little grocery haul here. So I'm gonna show you what I picked up. And these are kind of things that when Jeff and I are staying at an Airbnb, we usually pick up. I'll get a few things that are really easy to, to prepare. Some things might require a little bit of cooking. So if you stay in an Airbnb and you have a full kitchen, you have that luxury. Okay, so I couldn't pass these up. These look really good. Spicy queso and being in the States, I was like, all the shiny things. I was like, oh my God, there's so many things that I want, but I got some Halo Top. So low calorie ice cream was like a favorite of mine, but I've heard that the Enlightened Movie Night ice cream flavor is like the best one. So I had to give this a try. So these are some treats. And if you have a refrigerator and freezer, that shouldn't be an issue. I also got some Greek yogurt, uh, very high in protein, so these are good to have on hand. I also got some rice cakes, which are really good while you're traveling. So those two flavors of rice cakes. Got some oatmeal, and this is the cinnamon roll 100 calorie oatmeal. I saw this, it caught my eye. And then strawberries, I always like to have strawberries. It's very easy to snack on. I always pick up a box of Splenda because when you're traveling, most Airbnbs don't already have Splenda. So I always grab one of these for anything, coffee, oatmeal, whatever. My food group. <laughs> Jeff thinks this it's is like at a... the tip of the Stephanie Buttermore food pyramid. <laughs> I use mustard for I just love mustard. That is a personal thing. It has a special place in my heart. I love putting it on everything, including making little wraps with like deli meat, so I got this Applegate Naturals, I like this brand, but if you can't find like a natural brand that has like less preservatives and nitrates and stuff like that, you can just pick up cut up meat, so I got deli meat from the deli. Also really good if you want something a little bit lower carb, but you want some protein, instead of the wrap, you can wrap it in lettuce, so I like to do that when I'm like in a really big curry, just wrap the deli meat in lettuce. And then I also found Diet Strawberry Soda which hmm. looked very intriguing to me. So I picked some of this up. I like to have some diet sodas on hand too. Got some diet cream soda. Dang. And that is it. That'll last us for like, obviously was, this is not all for me. Maybe some of it, but maybe most of it. <laughs> but uh, I'll share this with Jeff and Rashawn and some things that are quick and easy in between eating out, which is gonna have to be inevitable when you are traveling. So yeah, that's it. I'm actually going to make some oatmeal for pre-workout. I'm just in the mood for something sweet and that's just kind of what I want right now. So I'm gonna take one of these 100 calorie cinnamon roll oatmeal packets and I'm gonna make it with a lot of extra water because I'm actually going to put in a scoop of the new Cinnamon Delight vegan protein. I don't have the container here with me because I didn't want to travel with it, but this is a scoop and I will insert a photo of what it looks like right here, but I've really been loving this flavor and thought it would go perfect with the cinnamon roll flavored oatmeal. And this is a big bowl, but this is the only bowl I could find. <laughs> So just for a change of scenery, I decided to move it into their dining room because the lighting is a little bit better in here. But I did make the oatmeal and I added a scoop of the vegan protein powder. So it made it nice and thick. So I'm gonna enjoy this and then I'm going to meet boys at the gym. They've already left without me. So I'm gonna hurry up and eat this. You wanna say hi? Say hi. Hi. This is Alexander. This is Jonathan. And this is Mary. <laughs> Say hello. The whole Meadows family is here. Yeah. Bye. That was delicious. So one more thing before I go to the gym. I wanted to give these a try. Macros are five fat, 18 carb, and two protein. I've had the popcorners before, but not this flavor. So I'm gonna give it a try. Those are good. These are super good, I highly recommend them, and the macros are not too bad. Mmm, I don't know, they almost taste like sweet, cheesy popcorn? I don't know, they're really good. If you see them in the store, pick them up. So I'm gonna mix up my pre-workout, the Kiwi Lime High Volume, and Prolific, and then I'm gonna go to the gym. I'm gonna do you arms. Should see, you should see John, he's such an animal. I'm gonna do arms with these guys right here. Let's go, John. So 
I am here at American Barbell. This is the gym that John Meadows trains at regularly. So this is a very dope gym. I'm excited to train here. They have really cool equipment, so I'm gonna check it out. Because I'm going to be doing um, lower body with John tomorrow, I'm gonna be doing an upper body workout. And if you're doing my program, my women's specialization program, I'm going to be doing day three, upper number one of the week. I'm not gonna show you the workout because today is all about the food, some chest, some back, shoulders you know the drill so I'm wearing some athlete leggings this top is from top shop it's just like a little crop top what a wonderful world. look at the shoulders holy crap woman you look lean and, and jacked is that all the donuts or what? What's the, what is that? I haven't had any yet. Holy I'll get crap. Six pack. You have to get the ab. One day. For my steps mom, I'll always say, like, you have to get the ab. Just one. You just, just, you just one need ab. one. <laughs> if I can get one, I'll Yeah, I mean, that you'd, you'd impress your mom at least. <laughs> Dang, girl. Striations. Oh my god. We should put you on my arm thumbnail. Is that it? So our post-workout situation is some sushi. I'm so excited, I'm so hungry, and I'm so ready. Let's get it. <laughs> Okay, so I got three different rolls. I got one that looks like an alligator. That's fun. <laughs> it has an eel on top. And then I got a smile, angel smile angel roll. Smile. And then I got an eel and cucumber roll. So I have three rolls here. They look absolutely delicious. I'm very hungry. Alright guys, this is the last piece. I can do some serious damage with sushi. Don't expose me. <laughs> yeah. Two more. I can I can smash them. I win. <laughs> I win the sushi get the sushi match. Winner. Hut, hut. You gotta run! Give me a second. That's all you. Oh, I'm rooting for her. Oh, oh, oh. Is this the post-football meal? Yes, I'm hungry now. Quarterback over here, or whatever you are. <laughs> First, I want to try this strawberry soda. I want to try this blueberry muffin. I want, I want everything. This is what happens when I get hungry. When I get hungry. <laughs> yeah, you barely ate today, right? Hmm. I've never seen strawberry diet soda. Dun, dun. Dun, That's dun. good. Yeah? Mm -hmm. So this is going to be a mishmash, which is usually how it goes when you're traveling. You just like eat whatever. I always like to have some fruit while I'm traveling. It's not always easy to get all your micros in. That's why I usually take a multivitamin and everything. These flatbreads I found at the store are 90 calories, 1.5 fat, 14 carb, and 9 protein. They're really high in protein. And then we're also going to try out that enlightened ice cream. Food group. <laughs> Anyone else love mustard? Regular mustard is zero calories. I can eat as much of it as I want. You can drink it all. <laughs> a little bit of mustard. Blueberry muffin, intrigued. Hmm. Not just blueberry. Mm, that's actually so good. I'm easily impressed. <laughs> Good strawberries, eh? Time for the good stuff. Yeah, we're gonna try. We're gonna do a, another low-calorie ice cream review. When I travel, though, seriously, 
because they have different grocery stores, different states, different countries have different food. So when I travel, I do have like my staples that I look out for, but then I always want to try something new. I already know I like strawberry pillow top, so I'm gonna have some of this. I'm gonna see what all the hype is about. It's called movie night. So it's like caramel popcorn. I actually That's don't know what it is. Different. So 2.5 fat, 18 carb, 7 protein. So it says buttery popcorn ice cream with chocolate bits and swirls of caramel. Okay. Oh, I'm impressed. Look at that. That looks, that looks like money right there. Oh, yeah, wow. All right, ratings by Stephanie. Oh, I should let it thaw a little bit. All right, got some caramel swirl in there. That's so good. Yeah. So if you can't, you don't have any place to store it, well, that's a good excuse just to eat the whole pint. <laughs> I don't know what I would rate it. Like eight out of ten. Wow, that's good. It's good. Fruity I already stuff. know that I love this. Oh. That's why I was gonna try this to kind of compare. Because I love strawberry. Yeah. So I I give this like an eight out of ten too. Because I'm a mm. I'm a big strawberry ice cream fan. It looks pretty good actually. Mm -hmm. Really good strawberry ice cream. Yeah. You guys know I eat intuitively, so I have no idea, like, I don't track what I eat, but it might be helpful for you guys just to see, like, what the macronutrient breakdown was of all the food that I ate today. Get a little bit more of this. I have a little bit more of the strawberry. Okay, so I had this much of the Enlightened, about half of the strawberry, and then I ate the wrap. I had this yogurt, and I had some strawberries. So I'm gonna probably cut it off right here. That's gonna conclude this video. So I know that it was like super random, and it was kind of all over the place, and I was like, I don't know, I was here, and then I was grocery shopping, and I was there, you guys got to see kind of like what I would buy at a grocery haul. Hope that's helpful. Anyways. I hope that you enjoyed this video. I hope that you enjoy all of my food videos. My next video is going to be a training video with Mountain Dog or John Meadows. I'm fueling up for tomorrow. Good luck. <laughs> the next video after that might be a cheat day. So stay tuned for that. Um, should be good, good time back in the States, getting all the food, all the food. I'm gonna put a video right here that I think you're really gonna like. And here's going to be a button to subscribe right here. So go ahead and click right here if you haven't subscribed. And I will see you in a video very soon. Love you all. Bye.